Hello everybody on YouTube. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to install ZDoom on any calculator from the TI-80 lineup of calculators from Texas Instruments. So this is like TI-83, TI-83+, Plus, TI-84, um, and above. I'm using the TI-84 Plus Silver Edition, which I highly recommend because of the higher amount of RAM on the calculator, which allows ZDoom to run um, at a playable frame, late, frame rate compared to the other calculators. So, yeah. First thing I'm going to show you are the things you're going to need. So, first thing you're going to need is Mirage OS. Wait, actually, first, TI Connect software. This is a uh, this is the software you're going to use to send the files to the calculator. Um, you're also going to need the most up-to-date operating system, which you can get from this link here. You just put your information in and select the bundle, I um, mean, the model you have and then you just submit and you'll have it emailed to you you're going to need the file itself, ZDoom which is a zip file and Mirage OS which is the shell you're going to use to execute ZDoom which is also a zip file so you just want to go ahead and download these two and now once you've done that um, just want to get it and extract it wherever you'd like so I'm extract them on my desktop so, um, the only two files you're really going to need from here is Doom, these two here, and Mirage OS. So you can go and delete everything else. Um, for these, you're actually going to only need one of them. So if you have a TI-84 or newer, you're going to use the 8XP file. I'm unsure how it works on like uh, the TI Inspire models with the backlit screens and everything on it, but for TI-84, you're going to use the um, 8xp file, so this is the one I'm going to use, and if you have a TI-83 or something, you're going to use the 83p files. So I'm not using that because I have TI-84. Then you're going to get the Mirage OS file, which is a TI Connect application, 8, uh, 8xk, and there you go. So at this point, um, you're going to want to plug your calculator in with a mini USB cable I already have. If you have a TI-83, you use the uh, serial link cable that is uh, sort of hard to find nowadays but that is what you have to use to connect it to your computer I'll put a link to that in the description if I can find it anywhere um, this is why I got the TI-84 though so I don't have to get that other cable and I found it at a thrift store so I'm using a mini USB which is what's used on the TI-84 alright so now what you're going to want to do is open up TI Connect software <clears throat> and then you want to hit send to TI device here click select device and it's going to search um, through your ports that have a connection so for me on my USB port I have the TI-84 plus silver edition so you want to do is click the device and click select and then here it'll say sending to whatever device you have um, now what you want to do is you want to go ahead and basically drag and drop the two files in here. By default, Mirage OS will be sent to the archive, which is a much bigger directory than the RAM. So you can also send Doom there as well if you want to save some storage. So now once you've selected everything and you have everything you want, just hit send to device. Now what it's going to do is open up a little prompt saying starting transfer and then it'll start transferring the files. Now, if we take a look here on my screen, what you're going to notice is I turn it on. It's going to say receiving Mirage OS app. That means it's receiving it and it's working properly. Now, it's going after that, it's going to send the doom.8xp file or a3p file. And then after that, you're basically finished. Alright, so the next step is actually playing the game, so I'm moving over here. So you just want to go ahead and hit Apps, right here. Then you can use this as the D-pad, just hit Mirage OS, Enter. <clears throat> now you're going to have this little folder here, and when you first install Mirage OS, there'll be a little splash screen. I've already opened it before, so... Um, to get out of the splash screen and just press any key. 
So press enter to open the folders and then enter to open it. Doom. And it will execute. So now what you want to do is uh, for some reason the select button is actually second so use second as a select button. And now when you open it up, boom! So the, this acts like as a d-pad here, these arrow keys. <clears throat> you can go backwards, forwards, left, right, whatever. Second to shoot. Shoot this bad guy here. Alright. Um, and you use these buttons up here to switch between weapons. So when you get more weapons, you just press these buttons. This one will be by default the pistol. Now to exit, it's pretty simple. You just press second quit, or no, second clear. And then to exit here, you just want to press second, and boom. So yeah, that was how to install Doom on a calculator. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I always enjoy feedback. And uh, goodbye.